Those of you that have watched my videos before will recognize this Magnavox AM FM table radio. Well, I've got uh, some parts to put in it today to fix this problem. And also I want to look into the AM sensitivity a little bit. So let me get her taken apart. So the one on the left is the one I need to replace. I've got 68 at 250 and 47 at 160 to replace 50 at 125 and 70 at 200. Okay, so while I'm in here, I went ahead and ESR'd the other electrolytics in the radio and this 5 microfarad here uh, that's in, I believe, maybe near the discriminator, the audio section, because the audio's over here. Um, that seems to test wide open, and this other power supply one, the 400, it's uh, borderline, but I'm going to leave it. Still barely within the good range, so I'm going to change out that 5 and then uh, give the radio another test. Something else here, the I believe the AMIF is a little out of alignment, and this is why, again, I'm looking for service data on this radio um, bring in a weak a station here of some sort. I can tell you what it is because I have it registered. It's called that's the center the rat king. and that's tuning away so it goes out pretty quickly but if we okay. decrease so we go back to the peak before that and then, I have another then go um, lower in frequency goes quite a ways it just doesn't seem to be as sharp going in that direction. So I'd like to get at least the AMIF aligned. Um, so, but I don't want to go in and just blindly start turning uh, adjustments because it'll never work. <laughs> it'll never work when I'm done with it that way. So to recap, pun intended, uh, the radio is on now. It's very quiet when the volume's all the way down. There's no more hum. And uh, I went in and adjusted the antenna coil. I didn't really get it much better, but uh, this station, which is not far from me, but uh, not very strong, is coming in pretty good, 1260. And um, dial calibration is pretty good. So for the AMs, working okay the FM's working pretty good but uh, would like to get a schematic for this someday it's not in the SAMS it's 1FM064 that's the chassis number so if anyone has any leads on Magnavox I'd be curious so no uh, leave a comment or just leave a comment anyways thanks again for watching bye bye